What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire walkthrough. Okay, so, huh, I think it's time for us to head on over to the Pokemon League because, well, many of you guys have been asking, kind of just like complaining at me, but then again, you guys are... You guys do have a point. I am uh, I am prolonging this. So let's go right ahead and do that. Now, I've been thinking this over. I know that I've been like trying to get a perfect team together, but like there are just so many Pokemon out here, especially now since I've completed the Delta episode, or not the Delta episode, but the, um, what was it called? Uh, I completed the, what was it? What, what, what's his face? I completed the, the Kyogre Groudon series that you know, it, there's just going to be so many Pokemon that you can choose from. And for me, right here, I think this is one of the big problems of Pokemon uh, Alpha Sapphire Omega Ruby is that there are so many Pokemon you can choose from. You just don't know which one you want to do. Uh, but then again, it's a positive mainly because, well, shoot. Um, I mean, it, it, it diversifies everything. I don't know. I'm just I'm just weird like that. I, I I am very weird when it comes to like these kinds of games and all that stuff. So anywho, we're gonna be going like we're gonna be heading from Moss Deep City all the way down to Route 127 and and on. And I think this is the wrong way. I already beat everybody. Um. And I don't think I I don't think I've battled some of these Pokemon. Well, probably. You know you know how I do things here. Uh. So let's see. Let's go ahead and surf our way. I think we've already beaten all these trainers. We can dive, and here we are in Route 128. Once you reach one Route 128, let me just click on that, if I can. There we go. Uh, it will lead us straight to the Pokemon League, and, well, it looks like to me I've already beaten most of these trainers, so there's no need to battle them. Okay, I was wrong. Okay, let's go right ahead and start, start the battles right here. Okay, so let's see. What can I do? Well, except beat everybody. Um, so yeah, there are so many Pokemon out there, guys. And I don't necessarily have one team that I, I want to use here in Alpha Sapphire. I mean, in Omega Ruby, I think the reason why I did have a team was because it was based off of Groudon's effect and all that stuff. Kyogre's effect is a little bit... It, it's just a little bit different because once you get into, like, what? The 8th Gym Leader and then going into the Pokemon League... Uh, Groudon has more of an advantage than Kyogre. Now, I guess, correct me if I'm wrong, guys. I mean, it's been a while. And, well, here we are in Evergrande City. And, we're gonna, yes, we're going to be using another Repel right here. And what you need right here is you need a Pokemon with Waterfall. And the person right here is like, I don't believe it! A Surf Pro like me can't climb a Waterfall. And what do you have to say? The Itchy Move Waterfall. Rumor has it that it, that you can't use it unless you defeat the Suitopolis City Gym Leader Wallace. Rumor? True fact. This is a true fact. And, well, that's exactly what we're going to be doing right here is that I am going to be... I am going to be using this. And, bam. Here we are in Evergrande City. And... Well, what we're going to do first, guys, is we're going to heal up our Pokemon. Maybe change one or two Pokemon. Maybe not. Uh, it all depends. But I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, so here we are back, guys. And, uh, well, a few things. I am going to be using, uh, well, let's see, Hydra, Linoon, and, uh, let's see. Yeah, Hydra and Linoon, mainly because they do have the HMs that I need. And as you guys can see, Victory Road is not going to be an easy one. Well, this time around and all that crud. So, let's see. You need Surf. You need Rock Smash. You need uh, Strength. Y you probably do need, what was it called, uh, Flash, which is a TM. And, uh, yeah, so just make sure to have all that. Again, the HM moves, complete BS and all that crud. So, let's see. We're going to be battling everybody just because, you know, we can. You know, we want to prove our might. And, well, here we have Ace Trainer Albert, and he's going to be coming out with a Sigalith right here. So, this right here is a, a turn of events right here, just because Sigalith, is, it, it's a Pokemon from Unova. So, let's go right ahead and use that Dazzling Gleam, see if it actually works against this guy. And, yes, it does. Holy crud. Oh, yeah. It, it, was it neutral damage? Probably. And Leviathan, without doing anything, do it gets some some points. And yeah, you're gonna be you're gonna be finding some uh, evolutions. You're gonna be finding a lot of stuff right here, guys. So just be aware of it. 
I... I think... Yeah. Correct me if I'm wrong, guys. If you don't get the, the national decks... Like, if you don't get the national decks after the Kyogre Groudon event... These Pokemon trainers will have, you know, the regular Pokemon that you'll be seeing without the national decks. With the national decks, of course, you're going to be seeing, you know, Rhyperior, uh, Sigilyph, and all that stuff. So, just be aware of it. Correct me if I'm wrong, guys. Again, it's been a while since I've played. And, well, look at this. Rhyperior has been defeated. And, uh, well, let's see. There we go. Hydra without doing anything. Grabbing, getting some points and all that stuff. Okay. Maximum effort. Let's see what else we can actually do right here. I, I really like to go everywhere just so I, you know, we can uh, we can find whatever Pokemon. Uh, again, make sure to have uh, a significant amount of max repels, like right here, because yeah, there is a yeah, it, it is a long road ahead, and that looks like to me like a like a good item, a useful item, and we found ourselves a full heal. Oh yeah, full heals, full restores, the the whole shebang right here. And I'm going to be switching this up because you will be finding way more Pokemon around here. And, well, this chick has just been waiting for us. Okay, so let's go right ahead. Let's go ahead and take this one on. And here we go, taking on Ace Trainer Hope. And she is coming out with a Frost Lash right here. Alrighty. Okay, so... I need, I probably need to change it up, and oh my god, Frostlass, yes, faster than our Pokemon, so now we are kind of, uh, what was it called, um, yeah, we're gonna get hurt. Okay, so let's see, let's go Dazzling Gleam, come on, and here comes a Shadow Ball. Yeah, kind of makes me want to get my, <laughs> kind of makes me want to get my own Frostlass, and come on, there we go. And that almost defeats Frost Last. So what I need to do now is I, I, I really need to switch Pokemon because, yes. And I think the AI right here is going to be like, confuse this Pokemon. So I'm waiting for it. And no, here comes a Shadow Ball. And Tommy JDF getting that critical hit. Let's go with a Blaze Kick right here. And bam, super effective. Say goodbye to Frost Last. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I am feeling good about that. And, well, Hope has been defeated. And we are going to continue on right here. So, let's see. We're going to be going uh, right here. That's the wrong way. Down here. And, yes, I was correct. You do need a Pokemon that has Flash. Thankfully, we have uh, Thunderball right here, which can learn Flash, and uh, Flash is now a TM here in Pokemon Aura, so there we go. And we are bright, and again, you do need a Pokemon with strength, and it looks like to me we need to push him towards the left side right here. Again, not going to capture any Pokemon right now because, well, shoot, kind of don't need to. And uh, yes, I did say last week I was going to capture so many Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I I found myself in a in a self-imposed vacation. Still, you know, from what's been going on, and uh, you know, for me, it's kind of like okay, I got to complete these games. I mean, I've been lagging, and uh, well, hopefully, we we finish up right here. Um, let's see, what else? What else do I need to do? Let's see. There's nothing. And uh, there is a trainer. So before we go to that trainer, I kind of want to see some stuff. And there's, yeah, there's literally nothing around here. So, yeah, there are going to be some Pokemon that are going to want you to capture them. And for me, it's like, yeah, I'm not going to do that right now because, you know, my time is valuable. Okay, so here we are taking on Expert Brit. And she is coming out with her, with her Hitmon top. Okay, all right, I see you. I see you, him on top, looking pretty, uh, you know, break dancey and all that stuff. So here we go, psychic attack for the win, and just like that, him on top, not happy at all. And say hello to Gaia, the fierce knight, at level 58, and it wants to learn stored power. What? What the? What, what is this? So. Stored power is the user attacks the target with stored power. The more the user stats are raised, the greater the move's power. Yeah. 
so let's just say we're doing calm minds like we do we max it out it's yeah it's not yeah i'm not gonna be doing that because yeah that's uh it, it that that to me takes a while just to do so we're getting experience and here comes a throw let's go right ahead and uh throw this throw away see see how see what i did right there guys it's pretty hilarious so here we go yes psychic attack for the win and well let's see lanoon level 45 and bam okay so that's another person defeated let's go right ahead and continue on our little adventure right here and it looks like to me wow like everywhere you go somebody's waiting for your ass holy crud okay let's see how it is okay so what do we got here Oh, yeah, we got ourselves a Mawile, and I probably should switch out my Pokemon because, well, Mawile is a Steel-type Pokemon. It does have the advantage against Gaia. Okay, so, let's see, let's see. There we go. Stockpile's coming out. Mm-hmm. Not gonna happen. Okay, so the defense has risen, and what we're gonna be doing right now is a Blaze Kick. See how that works. And Mawile defeated. Okay, alrighty. And, well, let's see. Thunderball, without doing anything, grows level 61. And uh, right now, you know, to be quite honest, Thunderball is looking like a Pokemon that I'm going to I'm, I'm going to use for the, the League Challenge right here. And, uh, yeah, I'm not going to try and capture that Pokemon. Uh, we're going to go down here. And, you know what, he probably does have some Pokemon of, you know... Probably has a Pokemon that I can be easily with uh, Gaia the Fierce Knight. So, let's go right ahead and take on Regan and good gravy. Yeah, we're taking on a Hound Doom. Yeah, that's not cool. That is not cool at all. So, let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Let's go with Leviathan. It's been a while, Leviathan. I missed you. I have. And who do we have here? Leviathan going with a Fire Fang. Or no, the... Uh, what was his name? Yes, uh, Houndoom. And, well, let's go straight for a Surf attack. And there you go. Surf for the win. And, well, look at that. Getting some points. And Leviathan grows to level 59. And the rest of the Pokemon are just getting some points. And here comes a Shift Tree. So let's go straight for Tommy JDF. Let's go. Let's see. What else... What else can I do? Um, oh, yeah. Okay, so during my little break, guys, I have been reading the comments, and some of you guys are just like, you know, you're itching to have Pokemon White 2 back, which it is in the works, guys. I'm sorry. Yes, I know. I've been lagging on that to, that game, too. It's just things happen. Things really do happen, guys. And look at that. Regan defeated. Yes. Okay. But, yes, that's in the works. Just to, to be completed, and I believe one of you guys have, have mentioned something about Pokemon Y, which it's also in the works. Um, we are gonna be we are gonna be playing Pokemon Y. In fact, I'm actually recording the episodes right now. Um, it, I I, I want to say that like it's it's yeah we're we're gonna have a fun time just like. Well, we are having a fun time recording the episodes because, well, yeah, it's, uh, huh. you know, we've done the, we've done this walkthrough before as Pokemon X, but never Pokemon Y. And, yes, um, I think it's more of like, okay, now, like, okay, it's just to complete these walkthroughs. That way we have both of them. And then from there, heading, in, heading into the following generation, which I believe is the Alolo region, which we still haven't finished. Again, my bad for lagging. It, things happen, guys. A lot of things happen. <laughs> yeah, some of you guys are probably saying, like, well, shoot, it's been a lot. Like, a lot of things have been happening, Draven. What else What else isn't happening? Or what isn't happening? I'll tell you what isn't happening. Good karma, I guess. I don't know. I don't want to sound uh, like a, neg a negative Nelly or anything like that, guys. But, yes, good karma. <laughs> Anywho, let's see. Um... You know what? I got the right team for this job right here. So let's go ahead and take on the this couple right here. Now, here, here's something that, that I've noticed, or 
Yeah. Okay, so when you have double, like, couples right here, guys. Couples. Uh. Let's see. When you have couples. And, uh. And they go straight into the Pokemon League. My question is, do they battle the Pokemon Pokemon League as a couple, or is it a one by one kind of thing? That's that's kind of my uh, that's kind of my question right there. I don't know. That's that, that's kind of that's that's kind of my deal. I don't even know. <laughs> so answer that question, guys. I don't know. It is a it is it, like I don't know. For me, it's it's like okay. In Pokemon, what was it called? And uh, Pokemon, well, in in the Hoenn region, I get it. Like in the Hoenn region, you're gonna you're gonna get like it's the where you know double battles actually started up right here. Uh, and you know, I, I we do have a gym leader. We do have gym leaders that you know we actually got to play against uh, in the double battle. So like I would I would assume that you could. I don't know, but you guys you guys can have an opinion. Let me know what you guys think. And, uh, let's see. I don't know. I don't know. We're going to be doing this to Armaldo. Almost sounds like Armando. And, well, look at that. Alrighty, alrighty. So, there it is. Another victory for us. Tommy JDF gets some points. And, well, let's see. We're going to get some, yeah, we're going to get a lot of stuff from there. Okay, so, let's see. We're going to be surfing, because we need to. And... Let's see. What else? What else? What else? Let's see. We're going to be going right around here somewhere. And this is the exit into Evergrande City. Now, if you go out here, you're going to be finding yourself a TM, and that is TM59 Psychic. A very good move. Extremely good move, I should say. And... Well, let's see. We're gonna be doing that. And... Well, let's see what else we can do. Let's go straight into this part right here. And... Let's see. We're gonna... We're gonna do this. Okay. So, we're gonna be using Thunderball yet, yet again for a, a... What was it called? Um... Thunderball for this, and bam, okay, so everything is good to go, good thing about, uh, what was it called, uh, the good thing about this Pokemon League right here is that, you know, well, they, they, did, they did switch up a few, a few things that actually makes it, made it easier, like, you know, believe, well, the obvious, and that is, uh, what was it called, uh, the, 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 well, the leveling and all that stuff, level scaling and all that crud, and uh, I don't know what else. I, I don't know what I was trying to get at. My, 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 I'm sorry, my head is in the clouds right now again, guys. Sorry, it's funny. <laughs> it's funny. Anywho, um, let's go right ahead and take on Expert Theodore. Theodore, you guys ever watched uh, Alvin in the, in the Chipmunks? That is uh, that is something right there. Anywho, let's go right ahead and take on Sock right here. And, yes, we're going to be going straight for a Psychic Attack. And there we go. Look at that. Okay. All righty. And just like that, we have defeated Theodore. Another question would be, like, okay, why would you... Yeah, why would you... Uh, what was it called? Uh, why would you go into the Pokemon League with one one Pokemon? I don't know. People. People these days. Let's see. I'm going to be going like this. And we need to press this. I think we need to press it just one last time. Or go like this. Okay, so we need to press it one last time before before we we uh, make a mistake right there. So there you go. We grabbed ourselves the TM-59, and that is a flamethrower. And Well, let's see. We're not gonna we're not gonna get attacked by that Pokemon. Um Let's see. What else can we do right here? Hmm. Is there something else that we need to do? No, there is nothing else except we, we, we found ourselves some good TMs. So let's go right ahead and uh, continue on our battles right here. Holy buckets. And... 
Well, let's go right ahead and take on this guy. Let's see what you got. See what you got, homeboy. Okay, so here we are taking on Ace Trainer Vito. And, well, let's see. Ace Trainer Vito coming out with uh, a very good electrode. <laughs> and, <laughs> well, let's see. Going with a psychic attack. Obviously, Ace Trainer Vito is going to be like pretty good right here. And he's going to be using a light screen, which will enhance its special defense right now. So, yeah, that is uh, that is not going to work. But let's see if uh, Dazzling Gleam will actually help us right here. And that was a self-destruct. So that is going to hit us. And here's another one. Here's another correct me if I'm wrong, guys. But uh, correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, self-destruct is all based off of the HP, right? Could be wrong. I mean, I've been playing this game forever, and it is it is what it is. Now, here comes a Swalot, so I'm just going to continue on. See exactly what we got right here. And uh, Swalot, let's go with a Psychic Attack. Now, remember when I had Venom? That was a pretty good Pokemon. And just like that, Swalot has been defeated. Okay, alrighty, and... Well, Hydra looking at level 35, and it wants to learn Aqua Tail, so... Uh, yeah, you know what? We're just gonna... Yeah, we're not gonna do that, and we're gonna just keep the old moves, and... Keep it like that, and here comes Darmanitan, so let's go right ahead and go with Levi Leviathan. And... Well, Leviathan, how's it going? Leviathan, let's go take on this Darmanitan right here. And as you guys already know, Darmanitan, a very strong physical Pokemon. And there you go. Just like that. Very, very, very strong move. And Vito has been defeated. Holy buckets. Okay, so let's see. Holy crud. How am I getting... All okay, I always put these on silent, but... Holy crud. Anywho, I'm getting a uh, I'm getting a call here, guys. I'll be right back with you guys. Oh man, you gotta love these uh, phone calls from your parents. Check it up on you and everything. Yeah. Well, you know what? I do appreciate those. Yeah, my parents check it up on me and all that stuff. Anywho, let's go ahead and continue on our adventure right here. So let's see. We already defeated that guy. We got Batman waiting for us in the midst right here. So, let's see. What can we do against Batman? You know what? We do have the Pokemon for it. So, let's go right ahead and just take on this guy. He's going to be like, uh, Dragon types are the strongest Pokemon. I'll prove that with the likes of you. Are you sure? Yeah, we'll find out. Right here on Dragon Ball Z, and his name is Egon. Huh. It's a pretty cool name. And, yes, he is coming out with a uh, Kingdra right here. This Kingdra looks majestic AF. And, uh, well, we're going to go straight for a Dazzling Gleam because, well, Dazzling Gleam will do the trick. Look at this. Dazzling Gleam for the win. How about that? Okay. And, uh, well, let's see. Leviathan goes into level 60, which is good. And Egon is not too happy. He's just, like, looking at me. He's like, you. They're not the strongest anymore. Sadly, it... <laughs> My question is, who is the strongest, like, what, what is the strongest type in Pokemon? I want to know that. And I don't know why I did that, but look at this. We are in another area of, uh, of this place. So let's go right ahead and put on another light show right here. So, yes, honest question, guys. Who is or what is the strongest type in Pokemon, in the Pokemon games? Uh, I'm obviously asking because... I'm so out of date. Um, I have, uh, what was it called? Uh, it has been a while since I've played the game. And uh, <laughs> believe it or not, I have yet to play the newest game, Scarlet and Violet. And uh, <laughs> don't judge me. Do not judge me. I am coughing like a mug right here. So let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Let's go with uh, Tommy JDF and give Thunderball a little bit of love right here. So there you go. And let's see what these guys have to say. Hey, there's some trainer talking to me. Uh, you you attack first and like we planned. Okay, whatever. Let's go right ahead and battle some more trainers because we can. And here we have Brains and Brawn. Oh, Aiden and Finn. That's a pretty good. Uh, that's a pretty good. Uh, that, that, that's that's a pretty good combo right there. I'm I'm digging it. 
And, uh, well, it looks like we got ourselves, uh, some pretty cool Pokemon right here. So let's go straight for a Brave Bird onto Primeape. And, uh, let's go Charge Beam onto Musharna. Not really gonna be effective, but it's gonna be something. So there we go. Musharna getting hit with that in a speed boot, or not a speed boot, but a special attack boost. And, well, let's go. Brave Bird. FTW. Look at that. Okay. And, well, Tommy JDF is getting some damage, but still, he's done his job. And, uh, well, Musharna is going to be going for a hypnosis, so it's not going to be a bad thing. I, you know what? Screw it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's go right ahead and, uh, I want to switch out a Pokemon. Uh, crap baskets. Okay. So everybody would be affected. Normally, I would be going for like a, uh, what was it called? Uh, a ground type for this situation, but, you know, knowing the situation I'm in, there you go. So here we go. Discharge, and that nearly makes uh, Tommy JDF faint. But Musharna survives and uh, holy crud it's uh, it, it's giving me a uh, it's giving me a bit of a, a pickle right here so let's go straight for a charge beam attack to Musharna and thankfully you know Thunderball right here fast AF and just like that there we go how's it feel to fail not good and look at that level 62 and well brains and brawn have been defeated I'm happy about that Okay, so, got to heal up our Pokemon right here. And, uh, let's see. Again, lots of full restores. Tommy JDF. You know, at this point right here, when you can actually afford, uh, what was it called? Full restores? And, uh, what was it called? Uh, yeah, if you could just afford a, a, a butt-ton of, uh, full restores, I would just suggest buy full restores only. Because max repels, or max revives, or not, wow, what am I thinking? Max potions... Uh, the regular potions, yeah, they, they're, they're just a waste of time. Full heals as well. It's, like, too many, uh, it's just too many, what was it called, the turns wasted right here. Now, here we are at the tail end of our adventure, and, uh, yes, we're not gonna be using a repel, but... I think we need a Pokemon out here that, you know what, let's go with Thunderball. Give it a little love, and, uh, let's go right ahead and see what we're talking about right here. Let's go. Look at this. And the funny thing is, guys, uh, I think you can go on up in that waterfall right there just to see what you can get. So, here we go. And, yes, there is a big old waterfall. Let's see what we can find. Oh, yes, we can find ourselves a pretty good uh, TM right here. And here it is. We found ourselves a TM81 X Scissors. And, well, let's go right ahead and uh, just... Uh, do our do our thing. It's about to happen. It's inevitable. Something is inevitable. And well, right here. And we are getting towards the tail end. And right when you make towards uh, make it towards the end, somebody will be waiting for you right here. Ah, Draven. I bet you're surprised. Uh, I bet you must be surprised to see me in a place like this. That promise that we made back then, thank you uh, for keeping it, uh, your end of it. It was, uh, really all thanks to you that I could make it this far, Draven. It was only because I lost to you back then that I became even stronger. I'm sure that you and your Pokemon must have had overcome a lot, too, to make it all this way here, right, Draven? Everyone's grown so much, and now we're fi we will finally get to see... Just what we, we could all do. Sitting here facing you again gives me chills. Oh. Okay. So. But I won't give up. I won't lose anymore. My Pokemon have given me the courage and strength to fight. I have to win for their sake. So get ready. Here I come. Oh. Okay. So. <laughs> little homie here is. Uh, he is fired up and ready to go. And here we have Pokemon trainer Wally. Coming out with an Altaria. Oh, man. The one time I needed... Yeah, the one time I needed a, a, a good Pokemon. But... It is... It, it's okay. Let's go with a Discharge right here. We are faster. So, here we go. Discharge. Thunderball. Giving it... Yes. Giving it the business. Now it's paralyzed. And here comes a Safeguard. So, it's a little too late for that right there. So, let's go right ahead and go with a Discharge attack. And... There we go. Altaria defeated. 
Okay. All righty. All righty. So let's see. Who is next? Hydra grows to level 36. And here comes a Roselia. So let's go right ahead and take on... Uh, go with Tommy JDF. Now, it's funny. It's funny because I do have quite a few Pokemon. I do have other Pokemon that I can use in order to... To, to, well, to make a, a full team, or to assemble a full team, but right now I'm using the main guys that I've had for quite some time just to make sure that, like, you know, we, we, we get something going. And, well, there we go. Tommy JDF kicking some butt, taking some names. And here comes a Magneton. So what we're going to do right now is we're just going to stick by Magneton and give another Blaze Kick right here. Holy buckets. And, well, look at that. That right there is uh, another Blaze Kick. And Magneton still using its sturdy just to mess with me. So here comes a Screech attack. And that, for future references, is going to mess with me just a tad bit. So let's see. Let's go right ahead and go with a Sky Uppercut just to, just to be cool about this whole thing. And there you go. And, uh, oh, yes, yeah, Tommy JDF. Still the man right here in Lanoon, without doing anything, still doing something. Well, gaining levels. Like, this is the one Pokemon that has yet to do something. Actually, it did one thing. Can't remember. If you guys can remind me, find the episode and just let me know because this is freaking hilarious. And, well, Delcati getting messed up. And, well, let's see. He's going to be coming out with a Gallade or Gallade. So, all right. <sighs> Maximum effort. This is his final Pokemon. We're going to go with Mega Evolution and go straight for a Brave Bird. And as you guys can see... Ah, uh, yes. Time to give him the business right here. Look at this. He's It's Morphin' Time. It literally, literally is Morphin' Time. And look at this. Wally has a Mega Stone himself. And Gallade is... Uh, well, he, he's looking pretty majestic AF right here. So here comes a Brave Bird attack. For the win. And look at that. Gallade. Just messed the F up. And well, Tommy JDF getting those points. Yes, sir. Okay, level 67. And uh, just like that, we have defeated Wally. -E. <laughs> you said you weren't gonna lose. You know what? I can you know I can uh, sympathize with Wally. -E. Like out of all my rivals. Wally is the only one that I really can sympathize because, well, the kid is honest. He's a good kid. Like, he brought himself back from an asthmatic situation to this. And I'm proud of him. He ain't like Hop or Barry where they're just annoying, you know. And I will give him the business anytime I can. Anywho, he's like, dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. Ugh! Uh, dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. <laughs> Draven, you... And your Pokemon, too. Thank you for not holding back when you battled against us. For not holding back uh, when you beat us. And, Gallade, everyone, thank you so much. I feel like I've been able to take another step forward thanks to you. Oh, I know. I'll give you the, this to keep. I hope it will always remind you of our battle with me and with Gallade and the rest of my team. And right here, guys, you will be getting yourself a Dawnstone. Had I wait or had I waited for this particular moment, then yes, this is probably what I would where I would have evolved one of my Pokemon, which would have been I believe oh yeah, yeah, Frostlass. But I didn't. And if you guys are wondering, I got it from Pokemon Omega Ruby. Come on. Give me a break. If you have a male Curlia as one of your partners, Draven, I hope that you might use the Dawnstone on it for me. I couldn't beat you this time, Draven, but I'll stay here to continue training. And one day, look out, I swear I'll catch up to you one day. When I do, promise we'll battle again. That's a promise I'm intended to live up to. Oh, okay. So, I believe that you can battle this kid every single day from here on in. So, correct me if I'm wrong, guys. You know, it's okay to correct me. I mean, come on. Come on. It's been a while. Anywho, here we are, guys, in the Pokemon League. Finally. Finally. After 10,000 years, I'm free. It's time to rule this Earth. Try and figure out where that's from. And, uh, well... Here we are in the Pokemon League, and a cool thing about this is that you will be able to find another Mega Stone right here. If you go into front of the Pokemon League, you will find yourself a Mewtwo Knight Y. 
correct me if I'm wrong, this would be a Mewtwo Knight X if you're playing Pokemon Omega Ruby. So again, it's okay to correct me, guys. There you go. Mewtwo Knight Y is now collected and ready to go. And uh, we're going to be going straight into the Pokemon League. And, uh, well, this is where we're going to conclude our episode. So... Thank you guys again for watching. Thank you guys again for staying patient as always. I really do appreciate all the comments and uh, the views and whatnot. In the next episode, we will be facing the Pokemon League, and I believe we're going to be doing it all straight. Now, um, while I'm taking this small break, I will be training a few Pokemon. I need to find the last few. That way, we can go up against the Pokemon League itself. So, again, thank you guys again for watching. I'll see you guys next time.